Liberty's first ever bowl game. In fact, this will be the first ever American football game that will be played in Explore Your Stadium here behind me. A neat feature about this bowl game, it will also feature the first ever national radio broadcast that will have an all-female crew. If you listen closely to that tomorrow, you'll hear a familiar voice that we became accustomed to in Southwest Virginia back over the summer. Melanie Newman, she was calling balls and strikes for the Salem Red Sox just a few months ago. But now on Saturday, she'll be on the sideline talking touchdowns and interceptions. After she and Susie Cool became the first ever all-female radio broadcast team for minor league baseball, she shifted her focus from the diamond to the gridiron, spending the football season as the Flames sideline reporter for ESPN+. Plus. One calendar year, multiple sports, and now part of two more historic moments. Newman says she's thankful for it all and excited for a good game. Hopefully, you know, girls and women are being able to see this and being able to see that they can have that impact in sports, you know, and it doesn't matter what sport it is, but on that wider scope, men have that same ability. I, this shouldn't be just a female only thing. This is about there being absolutely no play for gender role when it comes to pursuing the career you want to be in. Newman says her bowl assignment was the Cure Bowl even before Selection Sunday, but the fact that Liberty is playing here in Orlando makes it that much more sweeter. We should point out that the play-by-play -play caller on that radio call will be Jamie Say. Now, she is the sports director here in Orlando for WKMG, which is our sister station as part of Graham Media Company. Certainly should be an exciting radio call if you're not able to watch this one on any digital broadcast. Now, of course, we'll have more on this game, X's and O's, a little bit later coming up in 10 Sports. Live in Orlando, Eric Johnson, 10 Sports.